Shadi al Nahas, um, another medal on the World Judo Tour in a Grand Slam. Um, quite a day for you today. Take us through it. So it was a pretty long day. Yeah. Uh, I think my first two fights went very well. My quarterfinal went really rough. Uh, I think I have the kill or be killed attitude, and uh, that kind of gets me in uh, some predicaments. But overall, it was a pretty good day, and I'm satisfied with my performance. Uh, so you started this morning, uh, I believe the draw was not the easiest one for you. Take us through, uh, you know, what were you thinking in the first match? Uh, what were you thinking you know, in the second when you also had an incredible, uh, you know, Ipon? And then what changed? A little more detail about that. Uh, so I went in uh, confident. I believed I had the style to beat the people in my, in my draw, even though it was going to be a long fight. So, of course, I go every con uh, tournament confident and I hope for the best and I do my all. And that's, that's pretty much it every time. Um, did you think about, you know, your, your, your hip I mean, the throws that you tried, is that part of your style? Is that something you've, uh, uh, you know, practiced a lot? Uh... I think that just comes with my personality, I guess. Uh, I don't think about it, it just happens, sort of, and uh, just works for me, I guess, yeah. Um, you had a good day at, uh, at Osaka as well. Um, you've only you went senior uh, last year, later you know latter part of, of 2018. Uh, what's been that been that transition been like from junior to senior, being in the final of the Osaka Grand Slam? So I did the junior world championships where I got fifth. So it was a big transition because I need to gain a lot of weight to, to be one of the top contenders. So that's a process though. So hopefully once I, I feel comfortable in this division, I'll be. Uh, Constant contender, hopefully. And in the bronze match uh, today, you had uh, you were up against the Russian, up against the crowd. Uh, it was a very long contest. Um, take us through this uh, this long, hard contest, and then the the conclusion by uh, by the by winning it. Uh, I kind of like the pressure of it, even though I don't really try to pay much attention attention to the crowd. So I was just zoned, zoned in to winning that medal because I was the only Canadian fighting today. So I didn't want it to be a short day for us. <laughs> And, and about that winning score in the end, you, you were really um, emotional or, well, let's say, really thrilled about the, uh, the score. What was going through your mind when you were so late into the, the golden score? I just had to push, and uh, my coach, Sasha, would had to keep motivating me every time. I, every time there's a mate, he would tell me, keep going, push, push. And that's what I tried to do. It was uh, last few tournaments were a little bit rough, so I'm happy I, I ended up with a medal today. And finally, what's, uh, what's, what's your plan uh, going forward? What's the road ahead? And what can we expect from Shadi and Lahas? So you can expect, hopefully, a gold medal soon. And uh, so far, I have the Pan Ams in April. And I'll see with uh, my coach, Michelle, and everybody and see where, where I can pee next. But hopefully, gold medals are coming soon. <laughs> Thanks very much, Shadi. Cheers.